And one of the platforms that I use when it comes to building AI agents on my behalf is this one right here called make.com. Now they haven't sponsored this video or anything like that, as I always say, but I found it to be a really useful platform when it comes to the free specific AI agents that I'm gonna be showing you today. So let's jump straight into one of the first ones, which is to use it to build up a dropshipping traffic AI agent. Now this might sound like a little bit of a mouthful, it might sound a little bit confusing, but it's actually quite simple. Literally what you're going to do is build up an online store, an online store that's going to have products on it that you don't need to ship out yourself. And then from there, you're gonna use a specific AI agent that I'm gonna walk you through in a moment when it comes to automating the traffic to the store so that you can sit back and watch the sales come through the door. The reason why I believe this to be a great side hustle for any beginner out there is because of the nature of it in the first place. When it comes to drop shipping products, you don't have to buy any inventory up front. You don't need to spend that much money. And there's ways that you can automate the fulfillment as well. So whenever a new order comes in, you can use a tool like AutoDS when it comes to automatically shipping the products to your customers. So AutoDS is gonna be an integral part of this entire system. So first things first, you're gonna go through the process of building your site. You can use an AI store builder to do this for you. From there, what you're going to do is sign up for a 30 day trial with AutoDS. AutoDS is gonna be useful when it comes to automatically listing products onto your site. But as I just said, AutoDS is also going to be useful when it comes to the fulfillment side of things. So I'm gonna explain the AI agent traffic side of things in a moment. But when it comes to the automations and you know all of these different aspects of your dropshipping store, AutoDS is definitely going to be necessary. For example, you can use AutoDS when it comes to the price monitoring for whatever supplier that you're thinking about using. For example, if your supplier is considering to increase the price, AutoDS is gonna be able to see that straight away and they're gonna be able to adjust your price accordingly. Or let's say if your supplier runs out of stock for a particular product, AutoDS is going to be able to instantly see that and make the product unavailable for customers to buy in your store. And just generally when it comes to automatically fulfilling every single order, you're gonna see all of your orders populating here and AutoDS are going to instantly ship it out without you having to go in there, bring out your credit card and buy the product every single time. But when it comes to building an AI agent that's gonna be able to get traffic onto your store, the way that you're gonna do that is gonna be with Shopify blogs. Now, in my opinion, Shopify blogs are really underrated and a lot of people don't use them, but it can be a great way for you to get free organic traffic going onto your site without you having to spend anything. And there's also a way that you can build an AI agent that's gonna be able to, number one, write the blog articles for you, and then number two, publish the blog articles on your site without you having to log in and do anything. And before I go on to make.com and show you how you're going to build this AI agent, I'm just gonna quickly show you how this entire thing works. So someone's gonna come onto Google, you know, a potential customer, they're gonna search for information about whatever your store is about. So let's say if I had a pet store, you know, I'm gonna be able to post blog articles answering people's questions. So someone might come into Google and type in this question, which is how to keep your dog comfortable. So I'm just gonna type it in just like that and then click on search. And as you can see, there's all of these different results that pop up, but there's this website over here that I want to show you guys. So I'm just gonna click into it. As we can see, this is a super simple Shopify store. And within this article, number one, they're giving the reader all the information they need. But in addition to that, they've got all of these different links, as you can see over here, where when anyone clicks into it, it's gonna take them directly to a product page. So if I just click on this first link, let's see where it takes us. So it takes us directly to all of their different dog beds that they're selling. And if I just click on the blog page at the bottom, we can see that they're posting articles on a consistent daily basis. So that's basically how sites like this are able to get traffic. You know, all of these different articles are gonna be ranked on Google. And the more consistent that you are when it comes to writing these articles, the higher chance you're going to have when it comes to generating sales. So when it comes to building the AI agent, you know, make.com works in such a simple way. The way that it's going to work is that you're going to make a new scenario. So you're just going to come over here and click on this plus icon. And as you can see, there's all of these different platforms, softwares, apps, and tools that you're going to be able to connect to your make.com account. 
I've already made a scenario just to kind of illustrate how all of this is going to work and how the AI agent is going to work in the background. So essentially what I'm doing is telling make.com to look at a specific Google Sheet. And within that Google Sheet, there's going to be three different columns. Number one, it's going to be the title of the article. Number two, it's going to be the target keyword of the article that you're writing. And number three, it's going to be the main product that you're trying to promote within that article. So from there, make.com is going to analyze every single time that a new role has been added. From there, OpenAI is now going to produce the article. So if I just click in to this module, we're going to be able to see the prompt that OpenAI is going to receive. So this is the information that OpenAI has. I'm telling it to write a 1000 word SEO article with the title keyword and the product link. And I've also told it to format it in a certain way. And then of course, from there, whenever the article has been written, it's automatically going to be published onto the Shopify store. So you can set this AI agent to work automatically by coming over here, telling it to monitor the Google Sheet, you know, every 15 minutes, every day, however often you want to do it. But just to give you an example as to how it works, I'm just going to click on run once and it shouldn't take more than a few seconds for it to do. And if I just go back over to the Shopify store, refresh the page, we're going to see that there's a brand new blog article that's been made, it's been published, and it's also been formatted in the correct way. So I definitely recommend any beginner out there to try this because it doesn't cost too much money. Everything can be run in the background and automated with the help of AutoDS. But swiftly moving on to one of the second AI agents that I want to talk about, which is with an automated affiliate income generator. Now, the way in which this AI agent is going to be able to help you with this is when it comes to earning affiliate income. Now, for those of you that's not really sure of exactly what this is, it's probably one of the most passive ways of being able to earn money online because with this method, you're not going to be selling your own product, but instead you're going to be promoting someone else's. And whenever you make a sale, you're going to earn a commission. And the way in which the company is going to know that you sent the customer their way is going to be with a unique affiliate link. So essentially your only job is to send as much traffic to your affiliate links as possible and AI agents are going to be able to help you with this. And just to give you a quick idea as to how this works before I go into the AI agent side of things, I'm just going to jump onto Google once again and I'm going to type in the search term. It's completely random and it has nothing to do with this video, but stick with me because everything is going to make sense. As you can see, there's all of these results that pop up once again, but this website right here in particular is my website that I built for the purpose of me earning affiliate income. So within this article, I'm giving the reader all the information they need when it comes to using this particular software, which is vidIQ. It's a software that I use myself on a day-to-day -day basis with my different YouTube channels. And of course, within this article, I've placed affiliate links when it comes to using vidIQ so that I can earn a passive income even when I'm fast asleep. And that's exactly what's happened because if I go over to my PayPal account, I'm going to type in vidIQ right here. And as you can see, all of these payments vidIQ are paying me on a monthly consistent basis. And of course, guys, I know that this amount that you can see on the screen isn't life changing, but imagine I'm promoting 50 plus different affiliate products right now as we speak across multiple different websites across the internet in so many different ways and I've been able to use AI agents to help me when it comes to automating so many different things so that I don't even have to think about it and one of the ways that I've been using AI agents with the side hustle is going to be with a similar way like what I just showed you when it comes to building these different websites publishing these different blog articles and doing it automatically so if I just jump back into make.com again it's a very similar one to the Shopify method that I just showed you where you're going to be telling make.com to watch a specific spreadsheet. From there, OpenAI is going to automatically create the article depending on what's in the spreadsheet. And then from there, the article is going to automatically get published to your WordPress blog website. So this AI agent is another powerful one because again, you're not responsible for shipping out any products. You're not responsible for any customer service. Your only job is to provide the most accurate information possible when it comes to whatever niche and then from there you can now have multiple different websites all running at the same time promoting various different products and services and just generally making money in a number of different ways. 
And if you wanted me to make a more detailed video on this topic, where I show you step-by-step step how to build a website, come up with the niche, how to find the best affiliate products to promote, just everything that goes into integrating this AI agent in the best possible way, put in the comments down below, do the AI WordPress agent video and I'll get onto it ASAP. And also put your location as well so that I know where you're from, so that I'm gonna be able to tailor the video in the best way for your specific situation. But this now brings me on to the third AI agent that I wanna show you guys that can be really useful, especially if you're thinking about starting some sort of a remote work from home job. So if you're someone that would rather do client work for an existing business owner, rather than building up your own business, there's a way that you can use an AI agent to speed things up, which is gonna be when it comes to client outreach. In my own personal opinion, when it comes to starting a work from home job, one of the easiest ways or the quickest ways to get started is to use the DTI method, which is direct to inbox. And all this means is that you're going to find a business owner that needs a service done, that you believe that you're gonna be able to do to the best of your ability, and you're going to contact them directly in their inbox for you to be able to negotiate the terms and of course, make money. And the more businesses that you're able to reach out to consistently, the higher likelihood of you getting consistent money through the door is going to be. Now, just to give you an idea as to how this AI agent is going to look within make.com, as you can see right here, it's similar once again. We're gonna be analyzing a Google Sheet and within this Google Sheet, there's gonna be three columns, the name of the business, the email of the business, and the type of the business. From there, OpenAI is going to monitor that sheet and it's going to produce an email, a short, friendly, professional email that's going to offer services for whatever you're trying to do. In this case, I've been doing outreach when it comes to finding businesses that need a website built. You could do whatever you want. If you want to manage social media, if you want to help when it comes to SEO services, you know, there's a wide list of different work from home jobs. But by using this AI agent, you're going to be able to produce emails that you don't have to write yourself. That's going to automatically get sent out whenever a new email has been added to the Google Sheet. And for those of you that are wondering right now, but Sam, how exactly are we going to get the emails in the first place? Isn't that going to be the hardest part of the process? Well, it's not the hardest part, but there is gonna be some manual work that's going to be required. It's not difficult. There's a way that you can actually get hundreds of emails within a few seconds. And it involves you going onto Google just like this. And you're gonna type in this search phrase that you can see on the screen right now. All I'm doing is telling Google to scan the facebook.com site for this particular business. We're gonna be using Carpenter in today's example. And I want it to show me results that have Gmail on their profile. Pretty simple, straightforward. As you can see, all of these different results are for all of these different carpenters all around the world. So all you need to do from this point is just copy all of the information just like this. Don't worry if you copy the bottom part or if it looks a little bit messy, you're just gonna come over to a blank Google document and you're gonna paste everything in here just like this. My recommendation is to do it for as many pages that you can. You know, if you could do it for all the pages, that's gonna be better because that means that you've got the maximum amount of emails for this particular business type. So you're gonna do that. I've already done it up until page 16. As you can see on the right hand side, I've got 75 pages of data in this Google Sheet. Now, of course, we're not gonna be able to use it as it is. So what you're going to need to do is just copy everything once again. Come over to something like ChatGPT, enter this prompt that you can see on the screen. The purpose for this prompt is to tell ChatGPT to organize and sort the data. So I'm just gonna paste everything underneath it just like this and then click on enter. Okay, perfect. So it's already gone straight to work to give me all of the information that I requested, you know, the emails, the company name, the type of business. And just like that, within a few seconds or so, ChatGPT has now come back with all of these different emails. And all I'm going to need to do from this point is just copy everything once again, come over to a blank Google Sheet, paste everything in here just like this. And if I just scroll down, as we can see, I got over 50 emails literally within a few minutes. So imagine if you do that again and again for different types of businesses, you do as many pages as possible, you can possibly end up with tens of thousands of different emails. And with that, you're now gonna be able to, of course, use the sequence and the automation when it comes to the AI agent 
for it to reach out to every single one. And also you're going to be able to automate the replies as well and set up the agent so that it's going to be able to respond. It's going to be able to deal with the negotiations, the pricing, and essentially all you're going to need to do is fulfill on whatever service you're looking to do. Now in this video, I just wanted to keep it simple and give you guys, you know, the three different AI agents out there that you can use. I'm sure from this video, you're gonna be enlightened as to the potential of using artificial intelligence. And if you've learned anything, don't forget to press the like button, I really appreciate that. Don't forget to subscribe as well, hit the bell notification so that YouTube can let you know once a new video has been released. If you're someone that's interested in getting a little bit more information as to how you can get a business up and running, I've got a completely free masterclass. I'm gonna to leave top link in the description. And if you also wanted to watch another YouTube video that I made not too long ago, where I show you step-by-step step how you can get an actual side hustle built click by click, you know, using one of the methods that I spoke about in this video, you're gonna be able to watch that by clicking the link over there. Watch that straight after this because it's already helped out so many people. I get messages all the time from people that have been able to learn from it. So I'm sure it can help you out as well. But other than that, guys, I'll catch you on the next video. Make sure you stay safe out there. Peace.